So we are here at Formby, one of the best Lynx courses in the UK, and it's gonna be a family affair. My name is Peter Finch and you join us here at Formby, myself and my father, Chris Finch, and we are gonna have a nine hole match to see who is the best golfer within our family. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was very dramatic. Um, okay, but we're gonna find out who's the best golfer today. I was starting here on the sixth. This is one of my favorite uh, courses in the world, absolutely. And this stretch of holes here is absolutely awesome. If you are new to the channel, guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like button, and comment below on everything that you see in today's video. Now you're off 13, 13 now. 13, yes, 13, yeah. We're gonna give you six shots. Yeah, that's fine. Now, with the YouTube match play rules, internationally recognized, you can choose the shots, you can choose the holes that you have your shots on. So you can only choose one at a time, and you've got six shots over the nine, okay? Yeah, fine. Does that make sense? Yeah. Does that make sense, Sean? Yeah. Yeah, sure? I kind of said it didn't make sense to me, but I'm sure you get what I mean. First hole, do you want a shot on here? No. Okay, it's a dramatic pause there. He's getting used to this. So we've got about 380 yards off this. I'm going to take a four iron and lay up short of those bunkers. It's going to leave me a longer shot in, but I don't really want to go in the fairway bunkers today. So do you want me to go first? Or do you want to go first? Yeah, no, you go first. Okay, go first. I'll go first. Changed my mind, using my two iron. Wind's hurting a little bit more. So I'm just going to try and play a little hold up shot, landed in that fairway. Now, you won't, might not believe me, but I'm currently three under after the first five holes, started off like a train. Yes, I'm, yes, you, you're not lying either. I'm not lying. No. I don't lie anyway. What is... <laughs> Come on. Uh, that's a beauty. Yeah. Literally don't think I could have hit that much better. Yeah. It was coming Judged. around. It was coming around, Perfectly. wasn't it? Perfectly. Perfectly, job. Never going to get anywhere near the bunker. No, I don't think I, I got, will either. I got quite close to the bunker. Uh, yeah, so you got a little bit more room to the left, but your line is the bunkers. Yeah. Yeah, line is the bunkers. So what do you normally hit your driver at, Chris? More or less nearly every tee on the course. <laughs> I was meaning how far, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Usually about 220. But I'm hoping we can see your famous par three driver shot today, but we'll see. Yeah, yeah well, is it, any long, oh, is it a long par three? I will do. I don't think it matters to you, does it? Yeah, that'll be absolutely fine. Really good, actually, that perfect now. I think. I said that with such confidence. It depends <laughs> if he's cleared the rough, and I don't, I don't care either way, but no. <laughs> well, I just hit it on exactly the line that you told me to hit it on, right, right? over that corner. Is he cheating or is he? It never moved. It never moved. I'm not cheating. I'm just suggesting. I'm just suggesting. Suggestion. Pete, have you forgot something? Like your brand new phone? It's a test. Well done, you passed, John. You can stay cameraman for quite some time. Okay, so this is 160 to the middle of the green. Uh, so we'll go with the rescue on this one. You go with the rescue? Yeah. Oh, be good. Kick left. All right. Yeah, it should be really good. I think his pitch centre just depends if he's cambered left a bit. If he has, it's going to be amazing. All right. Yeah, he always saves, like, his best golf for these matches. Definitely giving him less shots next time. After I've trounced him at this game, obviously. 100 and, yeah, 160 to, pretty much to the pin. We were quite level. Uh, I'm going to aim very similar, just right to the pin. So where my dad's pitched, the wind is coming off the right, so... Should bring it round just a touch, I think. Come on, John, we've got this. We have. Are you, on my, are you, are you team me? I'm team you. <laughs> yeah, that's right. He'll be insufferable. <laughs> he, <wouldn't>. he will. <laughs> he will. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it was perfect line. Didn't catch it quite as well. Did you hear him rustling in the background, by the way? It's right in here. You hear it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, flapjack cheeks. It's like a, <laughs> like a northern, I don't know. I don't want to say cheat, because cheat's strong, like it's a strong word. Gamesman. He's a gamesmanship master. He's a dark northern master of the gamesmanship arts. 
<laughs> so, yeah, it wasn't pure, pure strikes. So it's just come up in a bit short. Got quite a big slope to contend with. Flag is staying in for me. I'm going to be a flagging guy this year. You don't know what that means, do you, John? It, I assume it means you put with the flag in. <laughs> so until this year, you haven't been allowed to? Oh, is that right? Yeah, the rules have, the rules have changed. Well, why? Um, I don't know. But it should give a slight advantage, statistically. Left to right, down the slope, second half. Turn, turn, turn. Oh, good effort. Not quite. Take it out for me, Pete, please. Out for you. Yeah. Loser. <laughs> oh, God. Using the old rules. Well, I always think that with the flag in, the hole looks smaller. Yeah. I would not disagree yeah. with that. Up the hill, a little bit left to right, maybe. Need to start giving you tips. Up the hill, right to left, maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's the, way, that's the way I see it, yeah. Right, OK. <laughs> Come on. Go on. Go, 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 go. Oh! Tell you what, they, they've got a decent amount of roll in them. I yeah. thought I was going to end up short. Thank you. All right. So what's the usual gimme rule? Is that, like, I thought it was a club length. It's up to your uh, it's, it's up to opponent. Up to the opponent, yeah. That's quite close, Pete. Oh, yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> I'm aware, John. <laughs> wow. 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 Well, I should have left the, I should have left the flag in. That's what it was. <laughs> I should have, that was, that was a little bit unexpected. I thought I did a good put though. It just kind of bounced out the back. Just a bit too firm. Yeah, John, see, so give are always up to the opponent. So he's been playing so well these last few walls. I thought, no, we'll still let him put that one, but there you go. One there up. you go. Second hole, hole seven. That's the one. Go. Which is, in total yardage, 366 yards. It's up the hill and around to the right. In my head, I remember this being a par five, but it's not, it's a par four. Might be a Mutong hole off the back we are off the winter tees. And you're one up. Are you taking a shot here? I am taking my, one of my shots here, yes. Okay. So it yes. does turn into a par five. Yeah. Like that. Oh well, yeah, because this is a very it's a very narrow fairway as well. This Super one. narrow. It is too narrow, I would say. So yes, we'll go with the shot. I've been one. I've been incredibly nervous hitting a driver but, off here. But isn't your driver your strongest part of your game? Yeah, it is. But it's 360 odd yards. It looks further than that. I drive it pretty straight, but I don't drive it a long way. So I'll I'll not be able to reach the green with my second shot on this one. So that's why I'm taking the shot. Oh, not so sure now. Uh, yeah, just, di just didn't get that one. Oh, wow. Oh, I think you passed it. Yeah, you see what I mean? Yeah. It's all right, but yeah. Yeah, it wasn't the strike you were after, no, was it? No, I caught it right on the bottom there. I mean, it's all right. All right yeah. I'm okay with it. You're just trying to give him a chance, aren't you, Chris? <laughs> no. <laughs> no way. <laughs> uh, do you know him at all? I'll be trying. Don't you worry. I'll be trying. No idea. <laughs> Give me a chance. I'm going to go two iron just because it's super narrow. So fairway finding is key. Go left off the fairway. Yeah. Bullet. Go on, scamper. Yeah. So I, I couldn't have placed it any better than, than that, really. Opens up the green a little bit. It kind of goes up and to the right like that. Get that move, John. So it's there, up there, that way. I am hitting uh, my five wood. Yeah, I only, carry, uh, I only carry eight clubs in winter just to keep the bag light. So uh, this is driver. This is my next club down from my driver. So it's on a bit of a tricky lie, but We'll try and get it over. Uh, it's just a line, really, because I've not played here for oh, 20 or 30 years, so. Uh, I got it a bit heavy, but that's not so bad. So he's in the dip before the green. We'll leave a treacherous up and down. Uh, I have 133 yards into the pin. The wind is kind of swirling around a bit. It was down a second ago, now it's left to right. So I'm going to go full pitch wedge, trying to land it 
a little bit beyond the flag because it slopes this way so it might give me a little bit of spin back but I'm not uh, I'm not overly you know not overly concerned I think good shot here we could have it I think so just beyond the pin straight at it window switch definitely down a little bit more now not the best strike in the world not the type of strike that you want to be getting today Ow. so my watch says 73 to the middle of the green which looks roughly where the flag is uh, maybe just in between clubs here I've got a 50 I've got a 56 degree in a, a pitching wedge I only carry eight clubs so we'll try and try and take the 56 all the way it's just on a bit of a uphill lie so we'll just try and get myself a bit tall might have Pretty to good. go Oh, ah, yeah. go. Just didn't catch it. Probably just on the uh, on the slope, I could have given it probably a bit more. I was concentrating more on the strike than the distance there, really. Oh, stay. How has it stayed there? <laughs> this, this is so weird. I've got two of you giving me two different commentaries at the same time. Oh, was he talking as yeah, well? Yeah, he's got. He's, to be fair, he was being quite nice. John, I have no idea how that stayed there. That should have been rolled back to his feet. Luckiest golfer I've ever met. It's a horrific pin, that by the way. No margin for error. Oh my god, that's, that's so hard that pin. Go, go up, go up. Ooh, that got the line good. as well. You can put a mark on that. Yeah, yeah. Leave the, leave the flag in, please. Yeah, that pin is is right on the crest of the hill that goes all the way down the green. And it's a downhill left to right breaker. This, if this is going in, this is dropping in the front door. This is not going to be a rush past, hopefully. So, should move from the left as it gets down there. Oh, Pete, talk yourself out of that one, mate. Ah. <laughs> New season, not quite in tune with it yet. Oh, bloody LP. That's a horrendous putt. It's horrific. I think, oh. John, that's what you call round our way a dead sheep. Dead sheep? Yeah. A still you. <laughs> Is it still me? I think so. <laughs> oh, I know. I think so, yeah. God. Two, three, four. Yeah, it's for a five for four. It's for a five, not a four. Oh, I have to go two up. God, what a terrible, terrible second put and first put. Oh. I well, just didn't strike the ball, did I? Not our finest moment this hole, is it, no, really? No, it wasn't. I didn't. I, uh... So, I wish we would have filmed like those first four. Like that <laughs> yeah. that would have been ideal. However, I can confirm they were very good. I can't hold it no matter what, it's all right. <laughs> Next hole. <laughs> so, par five, and as the last hole went up and right, this goes down and left and then up. This is probably my favourite hole in the course. I love this hole. I love this. Love this hole. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. It's quite essential to play. Um, Never used that word on a course long before. Uh, and it's going down and to the left. The trees, the lightest trees in the background, that's 266. It's 288 to where that red marker is. Your line here, Dad, is basically right on the over the edge of the hill, I think. Yeah. Can I, I can clear the hill, can I? Uh, yeah, it'll be a good shot, but All you right. can get it through. You All just right. don't want to be right. Like, right's dead. Like, okay. right is... You walk in the plank if you go yeah. right. He's it, doing night, mind games with you. <laughs> I'm, yeah. just, I'm just trying yeah. to give you an accurate representation of what the hole is. Well, seeing I'm, uh, uh, seeing I'm one up, I'll, uh, I'll take... Oh, no, oh, one no. up. Huh? Show your beans. One up. It should have been, John, but uh, I think we'll uh, I think we'll take another shot on here. Interesting. I think we'll take another shot tactic. on here. Interesting tactic. He's got two shots per part, really, if you think about it. If you split it down through them, so this is a good this is a good old to take a shot. Good old take a shot. Yeah. It's too far left for your distance, but it's absolutely fine down there. I'm going to go similar-ish line. To what you've just hit there, then? Yeah. But, but 100 yards more. That's what I'm hoping. 
Oh, ooh, a little bit too far left. That's going to be in the trees. Body shut down then. Just arms. Oh, that's my chance. Damn, Peter, <laughs> come on. I can't believe it. After the first few walls. I know. <laughs> They're completely blown up. Pressure, you see. Yeah, pressure. Pressure. Right, it's actually two. 225 to the green so I'm not sure whether to go with my five wood but there's two trees in where so I'll see I'm taking a shot on this and say Pete might be in trouble I think we'll take an eight iron and try and find uh, just try and find the fairway on the other side of the trees Perfect, I think, that one. So, yeah, not uh, not ideal, to be honest. It was a pretty poor shot. I, on hindsight, I should have... Oh, trying out a new tailor-made ball as well. I'll, I'll talk about that in a bit. But the fairway actually runs out there. It would have been better to actually play a, like a long iron up there and actually leave myself a good angle in. Bad course management, actually. Bad course management, bad shot. And now I'm just going to have to basically chip out. I mean, it's a par five, so... So not the end of the world, but it's not a good shot, really. Uh, so 7-9, just over there, just feeding it round. Leave myself short iron in. Yeah, that's fine. Couldn't really do any more. Sit down, look at it run. Oh, January is running out like it's in the middle of, middle of summer, John. Oh. Yeah, so I'm very happy with my second shot here. I've got 100 yards to the pin, it looks further, but it says 100 yards to the pin, so I'm going to take a pitching wedge. I'm not sure where, how big is this green, Pete? Uh, you've got a lot of room to the right. Well, yeah, but not, not where the flag is. Not where the flag is, no. Yeah. So right and long, safer. Right. And this is a difficult shot for any golfer, this, because it's right into the sun. As soon as you look up, you can't see anything, so... I'm just going to try and concentrate and keep down on it. Shot. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Very good. So slightly tricky pin here on the left of the green. Uh, it's going to be 100 yards. I've got my 50 degree. And we're going to cut to the Swing Quest cam and just talk about stern and position and swing arc and how you can better play your wedge shots using this type of swing thought. So with this wedge shot, my main focus is to try and get the sternum over the ball at address and then covering the ball at the point of impact. What that allows me to do is stay over the ball in the sense that I can bottom my club out after my sternum position and therefore take the ground after the ball. Now I think of my sternum position as my swing center. So drawing a line from my swing center down to the golf ball, I never want that moving away when I'm hitting pitch shots because the ability to strike on the ball first and the turf afterwards is going to allow me to get a lot more control over the fuller wedge shots. There are certain wedge shots where you want the sternum position to stay over the ball but the club head to pass the hands a little bit more so to use the bounce but in this circumstance this is very much ball first and turf. So if you are struggling with hitting the turf first and the ball focus more on sternum position to allow that club to bottom out after impact. You see that? No. Has it not come off, has it? We will, I'll tell you what, John, we'll get up to the green and I will show you where that's pitched and where that's ended up. Do you know when you get the feeling that things just aren't quite going your way? Let me show you. So my ball has finished here. Now it pitched. Up here. Is that it? That there. Yeah. <laughs> it was banged over the flag. It's pitched into the slope, got a little bit of grab and backspin, and it's ripped <laughs> all the way down to here. And as soon as it reaches the front of the green, then it goes downhill. Oh, wow. Brutal. It's a brutal game at times. But it's okay. Chipping solves it all. That's all I need. It's that little chipping. No. Yeah, nice shot. No. Could have been not, a... not what the doctor ordered, but to be honest, I'm kind okay. of... You can leave the flag in for me, though, please. Yeah, leave it in. Yeah. I'm up against it now, to be honest. I'm like, 
The chances of me coming away with anything from this all now are close to nil. Oh, he needs the one. Oh, great look, foot. Look at the smile, look oh. at the smile. Wow, nice. Thank you. So guys, <laughs> that is it. That is the end of part one. Thank you so, so much for watching. A little bit disappointed in my own game for those first few holes, a couple of bogeys and a couple down, but that's probably pretty solid. I'm gonna to have to stage one hell of a comeback in the second part though and we are going on to more fantastic holes so thank you so much for watching for me thanks for having us down comment like and subscribe and then see if i can come back into this will i get back into this we will see